Hi everyone, this is Kristen. I'm the Director of Client Services at Copper Hill, and today I wanted to talk a bit about trunk stock. Since inventory is typically managed and maintained in ERP, but your reps work out of Salesforce, one of the common issues we see with our clients is that they lose sight of the trunk stock inventory once it leaves the warehouse. Using a combination of configuration, automation, and integration, we can bridge this gap and it's easier than you might think. In Salesforce, we associate each user with an inventory location that represents their trunk stock. We then use integration with the ERP to pull through the inventory that's been sent to each of their bins. Now that we have this information in Salesforce, we can easily see their quantity on hand, if they need replenishment, or potentially if you need to pull their trunk stock back to the warehouse. The inventory can then be leveraged against opportunities, sales orders, and service orders, and we can use validation and automation rules to ensure that the products are accurately being applied to the orders. Those orders then get synced back up to your ERP through integration, and that allows the quantity on hand to stay in sync. We can use native Salesforce approval processes to let the reps transfer inventory between them. And the approach that we are talking about today can be used both for item level inventory management, as well as if you have serialized products or use lots. Thanks for listening, and I hope you got some insight about the problems we solve here at Copper Hill. Thanks.